Hey everybody, so this is my top 365 movies, or 365 days of movies. One year of movies, one movie a day, I rate them from 365 down to number one. I don't know if anyone's going to keep up with it, but let me know what you think about the, the rating I give a movie, or the place that I put the movie in my list. And uh, if you want me to elaborate and do a deeper dive into a movie and do a full review, maybe even a full video essay, let me know. Uh, I'd love to discuss these movies in the comments, so let me know what you think. Number 321, Eternals. I give it a rating of 6.80. It was released in 2021, directed by Chloe Zhao. Starring Gemma Chan, Richard Madden, Camille Nanjiani, Leah McHugh, Brian Tyree Henry, Lauren Ridloff, Barry Keown, Don Lee, Harish Patel, Kit Harrington, Summer Heck, and Angelina Jolie. The Eternals, a race of immortal beings with superhuman powers, who have secretly lived on Earth for thousands of years, reunite to battle the EV evil deviants. Now, many people would be already familiar with this film because it's been released recently. And I would say it's one of the weaker movies in the MCU. However, there are some strengths about it. Uh, for instance, one of my critiques of the MCU, especially in movies that are a first outing for a group or, or an individual, is they often fight the same thing. So Iron Man fights some guy in a metal suit. Uh, Hulk fights some big green guy. And and Thor fights a god. And Captain America fights a super soldier. And Ant-Man fights some guy that shrinks. And I prefer it when the first outing of a character doesn't do that. Now, it doesn't often happen in the first outing for team movies. So... This didn't happen in Eternals, and the story is actually very interesting. However, I do agree that it goes a little bit too deep in the reads. So, I can't give it a very high rating, but it's a very good movie. Um, well, good movie, and I recommend watching it, because you might enjoy it. Hey everybody, this has been 365 Days of Movies. We're going to keep plowing ahead. So let me know what you think of this movie. And if you want to discuss it further, comment below. If I get a lot of interest, I may very well make a full review of the movie, maybe even a video essay. So let me know what you think, and let's get to the next one.